And here's one of the best parts in the house. Right? The backyard. Nice swimming pool and a jacuzzi there. So the rain now busts down there, so I'm gonna pause this video and I'm going to help pack out our stuff because we now reach. Hey guys, welcome to our channel. So we're out and about early this morning. It's 4.30 a.m. So the reason that we're up so early is that we have a special trip planned. We're heading out to Miami. So we're now going to the airport and it's 4.30 as I said. So we're up pretty early and here's the crew. Joanna, Judah, Haley, and the rest of the guys in the back there. Right, so we have a lot of, you know, fun activities planned for when we go to Miami. So stay tuned. We're now touching here in the airport. Full clip. <laughs> and we have Dr. Pa Dr. Apparel out in front there. Eh? Alright, so flight leaving about what? 5 to Joanna, so we still have some time. It's now a little after 5. So we now done check in and we're trying to get something to eat before we head out. But the problem is like all about is failure. KFC system down. Peter Pit clothes, churches she cannot have anything. <laughs> what do you think about this, Joanna? Huh? So I have one. Can you tell me you get away? Huh? You tell me you said you need coffee right now. Let me see what's going on on the side with these folks here. Eh? Roshan, say something for the vlog there. See, look, Dr. Apparel, I'm staying here. Dr. Apparel. They're talking GFC right now. <laughs> what are we going to do? We got a bit. We're going back on the fish. Alright, we had to get something to set long, at least, so we might just scan this, so. Jana finally got she KFC. Jana, let me see it. Eh? Alright, so we're good to go. We're now going to start a body flight there. So I decided to deal with my KFC as soon as we boarded the flight. Right, and I don't know what it is, but I find the KFC tastes better even while it's in the air. You know, I don't know if it's something in my mind or what. And during the flight, Haley um, eventually knocked out because she woke up super early this morning to get ready to come to the airport. So we now touch down in Miami and clear through customs and stuff. How was the plane, right, Joanna? Good? Better than you expected? Alright, nice. We just waiting for my mother to come. She's coming to meet us. And apparently she's lost. So <laughs> we're waiting for she to come there. So once we finish here, we gotta go and do the next one. Eh? I'll go and get a vehicle rental, right? Right. Where are you going? Walmart? Right. And first time this crew is coming to Miami, so it's pretty exciting for everybody. And right, Nathan? So we now found mommy there. And we're going to meet her. Hey. Come on, Cherry, what kind of American you is? Oh. Huh? You getting lost in your own airport? something. <laughs> Come on, what kind of American you is? <laughs> so we so we came now by the car and tell her to collect our vehicle. And we rented this bad boy here. Yeah. A Chevy Tahoe. I think it's something like an eight seater. Alright, so I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to make our drive in this and have a drive in the left hand side. You know, the fun side vehicle before. The crew line and up there, John, look at the car seat. Yeah. So we all loaded up. And we're waiting for Dr. Apparel folks there. 
Daniel and Roshan are still trying to sync up forever. And here we have Haley. Haley was giving her a little trouble. Uh, we have Sherry Gill. Sherry, say hello there. Hi. All the way from America. Come to meet you in America. <laughs> so this vehicle realize it's a Chevy Tahoe, as I said, but. Real futuristic thing going on here right now. We could not figure out where was the emergency brakes and all the different setups and things. We eventually get through. All right, I see them guys leaving. We let me take off. So these guys had to feel a little hungry. So we come down to eye up here to get something to eat. We have to say there for the camera, Gail. This is my beautiful, lovely mother, all the way from um, Georgia. Say hello. Hi, everyone. All right, so she come to spend some time with us here. So, I up over there. We're just gonna get something to eat, and then we probably go to Walmart to do some shopping after. So this was actually our first time eating at IUP and I must say everything was delicious. You know what I loved the most was the pancakes. You know they were really soft and kind of melt in your mouth nice and buttery. You know so um, all in all the meal was pretty spot on at IUP. So we now done it there and we heading back out. And I think I love this vehicle and I check out this vehicle and this Chevy Tahoe. Huge. That's that's not the carpet. Yeah, I think I know the video with it. This thing do often. Roshan, we can wait here and there and there. As you be there. Watch that. Watch this now. You know. So this SUV is something like maybe some line size, so like a sportage or something like that. Or the sun. And watch this now. Watch how big this now is compared to that. I feel I might have to upgrade when I go back to another. Alright, we want to cook some good trini food all the way in america so in order to do that we come down here to walmart so we now buy out walmart and we now head on finally to the airbnb all who tired i think everybody real tired right now so we now making a trip back to our airbnb and we have arrived at our destination Right, so rest of passengers there. This is the Airbnb that we'll be staying in. So I'm just waiting for the people to come with the keys and stuff to open up for us, and I'll take you guys for a tour inside to see what we're working with. And here's one of the best parts in the house. Right, the backyard, nice swimming pool and a jacuzzi there. So the rain now busts down there, so I'm going to pause this video and I'm going to help pack out our stuff because we now reach. Right, I'm going to pack out our stuff and I'll give you all a proper tour of the house a little later. Guys, so this is our first morning here uh, at our Miami Airbnb. Here we have the beautiful Joanna with us. <laughs> How are you going this morning, Joanna? Good? Good, and we hand some birds. So... <clears throat> Just a little view of the neighborhood we stay in. Alright, this is some of the houses and, the, and stuff like that. <clears throat> Street. You know, and Miami is famous for its palm trees. <laughs> Lots of palm trees all about the place. <clears throat> and here's where we stay in. So everybody's still sleeping. Well, almost everybody. We have Haley. Hey, hello, Haley.
Saya di best pak tadi house we should see. <laughs> We are a jacuzzi there and we have two hammocks and also if you wanna just relax by the jacuzzi area overlooking the pool there you can do that as well and in our children that we are Going on the tree, right? So, here yeah, we have some a little different. I have a lot of squirrels on this tree in the backyard here. You can probably see them now, but earlier this morning, and a lot of squirrels just playing on this big tree in the back here. Have you seen a squirrel? Which what? Oh, we could have a squirrel up in our branches. If you could see, it's probably so good. Hi, hey, boy, up in the corner there. Later that day, we decided to visit the Frost Science Museum. So, we just got our tickets, and it's for the Frost Science Museum. So, we just came from one of the shows um, in the planetarium, the name of the show was the Living Worlds. Unfortunately, we couldn't record or take out any pictures inside here, yeah? but it was very interesting. Right? Wasn't it interesting, Sherry? Of course, very informative. And also, they, tell us, they told us certain things about life and how it started and mm -hmm. you know what technologies they are currently using to yeah. help to try to detect life in other planets. Right? So that was first thing on our agenda to do today at the Frost Science Museum here in Miami. So we have a lot of different things in store. Alright, so stay tuned. Next up we're heading over to the deep dive. This features a lot of different aquariums and sea life. Hey, what's that you guys got there? So that's what a sting, right? Southern Stingray. Right? <laughs> so they're showing you the different parts of the stingray. I think if you click on if you click on it, they tell you different things about it. Let's get that group up. Let's the size of that group <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
This part right here was definitely one of my favorite parts of the museum. Come on, look at that view. Now heading over to Ultimate Dinosaur section and as you can imagine what it probably is, has inside it Dinosaurs <laughs> So we're almost true, we just have like two more stops to make. We're going to feathers and it's to the stars. I think that has some dinosaurs or something like that that we wanted to check out. And after we just have one more one more item to do here and I think everybody's pretty hungry. Right Cherry? Yay! So we have to go to get something to eat after. This particular exhibition, Feather to the Stars, basically shows the evolution of flying, you know, when it started way back with birds and dinosaurs, etc., all the way to space travel as we know it. Just having a little fun as we end off our tour of the Frost Science Museum. So there was actually a lot more activities to do at this museum. However, due to time and everyone being tired, we didn't get around to visiting all the various exhibitions. However, if you're in Miami, especially if you have kids, I'd highly recommend checking them out. We spent about two hours at the Frost Science Museum, and after that we were all pretty tired and hungry, so we came to the food court at Dolphin Mall to get something to eat. So we got something to eat, so what we get there, Joanna? Chili cheese stick. Um, you know, I get it it's stuck a little bit there, Joanna. I got one, two, and a drink. And Judah got Burger King. So we're going to meet the rest of them there now to eat. No meal is complete without dessert. So after eating, we all headed over to Hagendas to get some ice cream. So 
So after a full day of toying and shopping and eating, we decided to call it a night. So we're now heading home to get some rest to continue our adventures tomorrow. So this morning we were still pretty exhausted from the previous day's activities. So we decided to get a little kickstarter so we're heading over right now to Dunkin Donuts to get some coffee. Heading into the pool to have some fun with these two guys. Amelie, look like rain going to fall. Come on, let's go. After some pool time with the kids, we headed over to Denny's to get some breakfast. We were even served by the in-house robot. I found that was pretty cool. Now finish having breakfast at Denny's. Heading back to do some other runs. So tonight is our last night at this particular Airbnb and right now is a lot of rain. Um, I kind of spoiling the evening for me because we had planned a barbecue out here in the grill over there. Probably can't see it so good because of dark. Right, but we planned a barbecue tonight and stuff and chill out by the pool now. But right now it's real rain. It's real gloomy because Hurricane Nicole apparently passing, passing through. And not affecting us too bad because we located in Southwest Miami, but it affecting other places of Florida. So rain or shine, barbecue must go on, right? The car stuff we. So I now have some chicken on the grill here. Right? Barbecue enough. You know? Right, and I have some, sorry, let's call it, lamb the bone after. I'm now giving them a first dip there in the barbecue sauce. Right, check out that sizzler, guys. Good stuff we talked about here. Right, then. Check out the weather, too. I'll tell you, rain shine. I can't stop barbecue. How are you looking at it, Joanna? That's not. I'm going to pop all of them in here and get them out of the stuff here. Right? So where's your thoughts so far? Smells good, so looks like. good, can't wait to eat. How <laughs> are you looking forward to the lamb or the chicken? Lamb. Lamb? Yeah. Now he's good. Huh? Alright, can Nicole in the background and Joshua? Barbecue into it. What are we having with this now? Some seasoned fries. Seasoned uh, fries or wedges? Uh, fries, I didn't get wedges. And, um, that's it, that's about it. Simple dinner. Simple dinner. Yeah. I last night too, so. You know, I just spent too much time cooking. Although we really hardly cook on this day. Well, last night at this location. Yeah, I was not telling her. Yeah, that's the next heavy I need tomorrow. Uh, I mean, I'm looking forward to see how that would be. Daniel booked that one, so I'm not really too sure. You know, in terms of the specifics about that. But I think you said that I'm full, right? Yeah, but uh, uh, I didn't even went in this pool. <laughs> I don't think I'll be going in the other pool either. What's wrong with this last night? I dived in there now. <laughs> I dived in there just now. Come on, I'll show them. Show them how we look at them. Take care of them. Check them out. Check them out. Check out the line up there. Mm -hmm. Right? Within maybe at 10 minutes again, they're good to go there. Maybe less too. So stay tuned. So check out how nice my plate line up here with the finished products. Right, so here we have some lamb, we have some barbecue chicken, we have some fries, and we have some cucumber. You know, we had to be a little healthy too now. Right, and all the sauces, garlic sauce, barbecue sauce, pepper sauce. Alright, time for the taste test now. 
Right? So yeah guys, 100% this thing tastes in a real best. So guys, that brings us to the end of this video. However, we have a part two where we visited this amusement park and we went on this boat cruise and we did a lot of other fun activities. So be sure to check out part two of our Miami trip. Also, if you like the content we are creating, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the notification bell so you'd be notified once a new video is released. Thanks again for viewing. See you soon.